happened to find the secret documents describing the bug. And this is a collection of all the hidden passages from all over the world, even though we're in space, based on that document. This is the secret to my personal hidden warehouse. There's still 17 or 18 I haven't opened yet. I search for them every time we disembark, but it's tough. Well, doesn't it seem fun? Almost like a treasure hunt, right? Well, the ones on this ship are mine, so don't open them. Uh, yeah, I already found a couple of these doors. That's my Xion, your sharp as attack. Thank you very much. And we received the segment file. Very nice. And here we find segment address number seven. Uh, but now we can actually start... Yeah, I know, back into the menu. <laughs> been doing that a lot this session. Uh, segment file should be... Is it on the plugin? Mail and database. Where's the segment file? Oh, it's... Isn't it? I think it's an item. Which is weird. I was thinking... Uh, segment file. There we go. So, here we can see that there are 18 doors. Um, and there's something here. They don't really show. Um... They'll, they'll tell you where it is. The, the other one's probably going to be the key. And then once you get uh, whatever's inside, the star will light up. I, I believe that, that is the way that it works. Uh, I don't want to spoil too much, but yes, there's going to be treasure in it. I mean, it, it, it is optional. They better give us some good damn treasure. And you can see on the right here, kind of like a humanoid looking thing. But it's very nondescript. So we'll move on from there. Uh, I can play you know, eggs mini game, and I can play a, a drill game. I might show those off. I probably will eventually. We'll get there. We'll get there. Now we can try to go. Well, let's try to talk to people here a little bit. Right? Do I think the gnosis are real? I already fought against a couple of fake ones. I assume that they're real. They're telling the public that they don't exist, much like the Loch Ness Monster or the Abominable Snowman. How dare you say that Nessie is not real? I wrote her once. I owe her a tree fitting. Fine, we'll head over here. Yes, there's another email here. God. <laughs> like I said, I'm, I'm sorry, but this is, this is the informational section of the Let's Play. And here, Namco is just flat out advertising. I don't remember this game at all, Ninja Assault. If this is real or not, I, I honestly couldn't say. I, I don't remember this game at all. Uh, GunCon 2 compatible? I don't think this is real. Um, but it could be, <laughs> Ninja Assault. It's not ringing any bells for me. We have to talk to the buddy about Ninja Assault. This must be the interesting email somebody mentioned I'd be getting earlier. Sounds like fun! I enjoy video games! I don't. God, a shooting game called Ninja Assault. It doesn't look bad, like... I mean, it's just a screenshot, but... You know what I'm gonna say? It doesn't look bad. So let's just move on, for now. Apparently he's getting ditched. Hooray! Let's just move on again. We will make it to the bridge eventually. I, honestly, I hope we'll make it this session. I can't guarantee it though. Actually, that's the way to the bridge right there. What's so great about Reallians? There's no way you can trust those puppets. You know what happened in Milsha, don't you? Who knows, the one on board this ship might go crazy too. So apparently at Mish Milsha, the Reallians went crazy. Is that, is that what the incident was? The Milshan conflict? Enough is enough already. Don't blame them for everything. Shut up. I've had enough of your equal rights for realians, and it goes against humanity crap. The realians on this ship aren't like the old models that were assigned to Milsha. An incident like that will never happen again. How can you be so sure? After all, they're nothing but combat weapons. See, once again, the debate is, is pretty forward here. I mean, they're, they're not made of mechanical parts. They're made of carbon-based tissue. At what point do you say they are not human? Whenever I look at this switch, I hear a voice. Press me. Hurry up and press me. I dare you to press me. Can, can't you hear it, too? I, I kind of feel like I do. We'll just ignore it for now, though. 
through this other side. Yeah, she gets a little hard to control sometimes. <laughs> Can I go through this door? No. Why can't I go through that door? Can I do anything with that? No. Not yet. My old habits don't pick up when I see those. <laughs> the hell is that? They're the Seraphim sisters. They, oh, they're singers, apparently. But they're not very good at, at dancing. How about you? If you try to change that marine over there, it goes into a rage. Uh, they don't let them out often, no. No, they don't. Ah, oh, apparently these are the best quality holograms ever. The entire crew panicked. It was utter chaos. It was awesome because we made a Gnosis hologram. Nice. Right, they're laid back. You never know when we'll be under attack. I've never fought Gnosis before, but I think they have a good gra I have a good grasp of how terrifying they are. Not even the state-of-the-art ship will stand a chance against them. That does not sound good at all. Can I go in here? I can. And I do find another save point. I can still go. I can still go. I want to make it to the bridge, damn it. I didn't even see what he said. Where, where'd, you, where'd you put what? What? Are they both saying the same thing? Hey, no. There's a treasure chest in there. I want it. Give me the treasure chest. Damn it. He looks like he was going to head in. He doesn't know, though. He doesn't know. No. Oh, open the door. There we go. Fine. Let's just continue heading left, then. What? Did I cock block him somehow? Hey, wow. another segment door. Number 16. So we're finding a ton of doors here, but no keys. How am I supposed to get into this stuff? How you doing? Yeah, I did. I just saw him in the Realian Infirmary. Strange, why would he go there? I thought he was a DME addict. Everybody knows it shows on your skin. Ah, so he is a DME addict, yes. Yes, you, like I said, you can tell because of the skin it hardens and all that kind of stuff. Let's head over here. I know. Uh, I know. So, we do find a ladder here. Let's go up the ladder. They're just beating around the bush. Like I said, you can take all the time getting to the bridge that you want. What's this? Stay show name and rank. Oh, you're vector personnel. You see, this is an emergency hatch, so there's no airlock. Everything will get sucked out if you open this in space, so please stay away from it just to be safe. I don't think I can do anything with it. I'll, I better leave it alone just in case I actually could, but I'm pretty sure I can't. I can't do anything with that? Interesting. I can, run, I can run past it, but I cannot. So this is all information that I'm sure will be of no use anytime soon. Let's just move on and talk to the soldier. In investigating the disappearance of a planet. Apparently that's what we're doing. I thought we'd be out here for at least half a year. Now we've picked up that one little piece of flotsam. That's it. Put all that down. So apparently there was a disappearance of a planet. And that giant gold thing was all that we found there. So. I'm. I'm oh. Hey, you want to play a game? I don't have a choice. We're just going to play tag. Oh, I remember this. This is important, believe it or not. This is training. We're going to try to catch you, all right? All you got to do is get that item behind us without getting caught, and you win. Don't try to charge straight through us. No, that won't work. Uh, you need to watch your opponent's move and use the feature of the corridor to your advantage. This, I mean, this is important. You're going to need to know how to do this. Ready? Here, here we go. And you, So you want to run away. It does appear like they're faster than you. That's just because you went down the ramp. So you just run around. Uh, run! I can do it! I can do it! Run! Run! Oh, apparently I didn't do it. That was disappointing. 
But that's the general trick. Can I do that again? I think there's an item I get from that. They... Yeah, they do. Can I play again? I want to get that item. Yes. Right. Yes, come on. Oh, I ran past the item, didn't I? There we go. Okay. Yes, they are choosing. Damn it. Run, run, run. Around here. Hoop. Hoop. Doing a lot better this time. They are not even close to me. But that's how you do it. You have to go back and around. And that's how you get around them. Ta-da! Got the item. I ran right past it before, didn't I? Not bad, not bad at all. With those moves, you'll do fine. You'll be fine even when things get hot. I'm always hot, baby. And you get a med kit out of that. Nothing that great, but I will take it. Um, you could get two more from them if you do that two more times. Then they'll say that they've run out. I'm not going to bother doing that. Med kits aren't that great. We already have the upgrade, of course. So. I'm just going to move on, and I'm actually going to head northwest from here. And I know, we're, we're like, like I said before, we're just kind of ignoring a whole portion. <laughs> well, the, not necessarily the plot, but we're, we're avoiding the bridge for now. Strangers took over the hangar and filled it with their stuff. There's no room for our equipment, which is all out here. So let's just head in here, then, and... Hopefully we can find something good, worthwhile, something like that. What is in here now? There's not going to be any cutscenes for a while, I don't think. Hey, what's up? This is an eggs capsule. You can carry on them inside and deploy it as necessary. So you, it uses the same space compression technology used in transportation. What? I'm not sure I understand. So there's some kind of compression going on here. No, you don't. What? He doesn't have anything special unless I'm sending something? I don't know what you're on about. I have to escort an investigation we know nothing about and take, in, take on enemies that we know even less about. But when things really hit the fan, we're the ones who have to bear the real brunt of it. The full brunt of it. We should just leave it to the realians to get their asses kicked by those ghosts. Everybody refers to them as ghosts. What the hell are you talking about? What can I help you with today? I'll sell you whatever you need real cheap. So he is the first shop that we come across in the game. And we can buy whatever we want from him, really. We can buy skate packs, ether packs, uh, for uh, ether point recovery, med kits, of course, for HP recovery. Uh, biospheres, very, very nice. They're, they work very similar to elixirs in the Final Fantasy franchise. They have fixed the price of these for um, from Xenogears. If you remember the, uh, I believe they were Omega Sols, were ridiculously cheap. These are actually more expensive than the Ether Packs. Which is nice. Not as, uh, not as expensive as revives, though. I don't think I'm going to need anything from him at this time. Um, so, I'm, I'm just going to leave that alone. Actually, though, no, he sells more than this. He also sells a uh, uniform, which Xion has equipped, and a protector, which Xion also has equipped. Is that it? Yeah, that's it. Okay. That is all that he does. Interest. Uh, you know that vaporizer plug-in being used experimentally in the simulator? Yeah, I remember it. Yeah, I, I tested it too. It destroys obstacles via connection gear. They're announcing a working model soon, so Vector is saying that's prototypes. If you're interested, come back later. Also, very, very important. I believe I can go in here and actually talk to people in here as well. I uh, signed Nigs already. First in my class to get assigned, so I'm so proud. Fair enough. Does that look familiar to anybody else? Looks familiar to me. You have no idea just how terrifying they really are. Only after fighting them will you realize just how futile it is. 
I did fight them, didn't I? They weren't that difficult. Here to use the simulator? Um, yeah, we'll use it once. We'll use it once. We'll put off the bridge even further. Yeah, what do you want me to say? Please be sure to use it. Yeah. You have people who fight barehanded, but that defeats the purpose of the simulator. Anyway, <laughs> good luck. Honestly, I prefer doing it uh, without the eggs. Okay. Uh, Here we go. Um, but because it is the simulator, fine. We will get in the eggs. Uh, it doesn't really matter. I mean, why don't you say this eight eggs? Don't think I can kill them. Let's go for the 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 yeah semi-automatic machine gun, the SMG. Which damage does that do? 101. Not bad. Not bad. Of course, we're not getting very much damage on this at all. As you can see, I have uh, 15 more tries left before I have to do it again. Let's try doing this. It's critical, so it's hard to tell which one does more damage. I should be able to finish this guy off and get points, because he's only got five health left. Give me the points! So that's the simulation. It's pretty much a battle. Now you get points times two, damn you. Give me a points times 10. Yeah, they don't say anything. Holy crap, look at that. Uh, now, if you require level grinding, this would be the place to do it, because of course, it's really easy to get a full heal out of this. Uh, I did finally get enough tech points. Very nice. So I will show leveling up the techs. There is one in particular that I would like to do. Tech attacks. Xion, use the tech points on Spell Ray. I'm not going to do Lightning Blast. I'm going to do an Ether Beam, because if, well, it sounds more useful. <coughs> Almost give away something right there. No, it's more useful. That's that's how I'm going to phrase it. Level that up. Change to high. Can't be upgraded any more than that. So now I need to set. I don't believe. Yeah, I can't use anything here when I'm near, but when I'm far, I can use spell ray. Very very nice. So now I can use spell ray every time I fight. Uh, I d I won't bother showing that just yet because we will have opportunities to show that later. So yeah, we're going to be fighting more. And I do believe <laughs> that we are finally, finally ready to move on. Go to the bridge, which is where we have needed to go for this entire session. <laughs> um, but I've been avoiding it. Uh, you can see a treasure chest there now. Uh, I, well, you probably could have seen it before, and I just didn't notice. It's there, but there's no way for us to get to that just yet. I don't have the vaporizer plug in. Uh, is there a shortcut through here? I want there to be. That doesn't necessarily mean there is one. Um, eh, it's somewhat of a shortcut, I think. I think I have talked to everybody here. So let's just head back out here. And I think we need to go back to D05, I think it was. And then we can... Ah, oh, crap. This is back further than I wanted to go. Damn it. It was a little bit of a shortcut, but I ended up taking the wrong path out of it. We need to go over to the right here. Remember, that is where we got the segment address. Where the guy gave us the file so that we could look at all the doors that we can't open. But now we can finally make it to the bridge. Here. What is up, dude? Yes, thank you. Captain Six, please hurry. <laughs> it's only been like, what, three and a half, four hours? That's what it feels like. Uh, that's probably the total game time. All right, let's head to the bridge. Hopefully things will work out better here. Anything good here? What's up, people? Hey, uh, Cherenkov? Cherenkov, you're ten minutes late. It's no wonder that your research is behind schedule. Ten minutes? Ten minutes late. That's it? Fine. 
Instead of taking up more time with your apologies, you should hurry up and present your report to the captain. No. Go talk to everybody around here first. It was Cosmos, right? The battle android? I hope it does well. I hope it doesn't do anything. I hope we don't need it. Flowing objects are console pods built exclusively for the new 100 series observational unit Realians. Fortunately, the 100 series observational units haven't been issued yet. It'd be helpful if they were, but we're just fine on our own for now. Uh, pretty much they're saying that uh, these 100 series will take over uh, their jobs here on, on the bridge. Um, we will be seeing them eventually. The modern warship cannot exist without a network of fleet. No, the military itself is like a giant living entity. A mere link with this ship can mobilize several thousand troops. And that's just through one synapse. This is, I don't know, I love the NPCs in this game. So I will be talking to as many of them as I can. If I could ever find the right angle to talk to this. Fine, I'm done with, no, fine, I'm not done with you. This isn't good. Looks like they use low-grade coal and the exhaust is too thick. At this rate, they'll see us coming from beyond the horizon. What the hell are you talking about? The main engine on this ship is the sweet The Model 2. A cutting-edge logical drive. It doesn't use coal. <laughs> That'd be weird. Coal, so passe. Looks like we came in contact with something in hyperspace. The outer coating on the port side was damaged. I wonder if it'll hold out. I suppose we can call in a picket. A wax. I don't. I don't remember them ever saying that one. For escort and support if things get hairy. 